I'm getting ready to microchip one of our golden retriever puppies. So I thought I'd start by showing you what microchips we are using. Today we're going to use the AKC Reunite microchip. It comes with a brochure that you can fill out and send back to AKC to register your animal's microchip number for its life. It costs $24.95 and that is a lifetime. It comes with a plastic temporary tag and then once they receive the microchip information, they will send you a more permanent tag for the dog's collar. It comes with um, six scanning codes that you can use in your records of their number. If your dog is AKC registered, they make it pretty easy to fill out the dog's registration information and just add the reunite fee, and it's also cheaper. So if you do the registration for the microchip at the same time you register your dog, it's only $17 for a lifetime. So that's usually what we do with our dogs. It comes in a sterile package, and there's the needle. There's the microchip. So before we get started, I like to get everything set up. We have a snuffle mat and we put some of the puppy's dog food in it, keeps them distracted. We have some of their favorite treats. I have the microchip here and now I'm ready to grab the puppy. This here is Lady and she's 12 weeks old. We usually microchip our puppies before they head to their new homes around eight, nine, or ten weeks. Yeah. And it's pretty rare that they cry. We usually don't have puppies that get very upset. They hardly notice, even though it does seem like a pretty big meal. They really doesn't seem to bother them at all. with the dog food and give her some cheese squeeze which is her absolute favorite treat. Can you get some cheese squeeze on your finger? So we want to put the microchip right here in her neck right. We feel where the shoulder blades are and, yeah, just give it to her. and we're going to lift up the skin and we're going to go parallel with her skin. We're gonna push it all the way in, push the microchip in, pinch the skin, and pull it out. And she didn't even cry. We hold the skin when we're coming back out to make sure that microchip stays in the skin. And I can actually feel the little microchip right here in her neck. Sometimes you can feel them, sometimes you can't, but this time I was able to. And as you can tell, it's a pretty easy procedure. It doesn't bother the puppies and it's a super important thing to do. Um, if you purchased your dog or adopted your dog, you need to make sure that it has a microchip because this is one way that your pet can be returned to you if they are ever lost. And it just really can um, help you reconnect with your pet. It also is proof of ownership that this is our dog and it came from us should we need to prove that this is one of our puppies. So if you have any questions, let us know in the comments and thanks for watching.